Good morning. It is another beautiful late summer morning here in northern Vermont. I don't know if you can see the sky, but it's absolutely gorgeous. Everybody's out. We're like stumped and I'm replacing the water in Lulu and Huynh's big tub. Once a week I do that. I scrape all the buckets and once a month they all get uh, disinfected with some chlorine. And so now, today, I'm going to be showing you how I clean the shed, which in the summer is super easy and fantastic where my two live. It takes five to ten minutes to, for both horses. In the winter, it sucks. And I'll probably do another video in the winter when there's a foot of snow on the ground to show you how much it sucks. So, let's get going. This is Huynh's side. As you can see, she could poop outside of this stall, but she does not. And I swear the two of them come up from the field just to pee in here during the day. At least she's neat about it, even though she does poop in here. She doesn't actually use up a lot of shavings, which is another nice thing about the, having them outside. They use up a lot less shavings than the horses inside. to look at it right now. When they pee, they, it spreads out underneath, so there's usually a top layer of shavings that are perfectly fine that you don't have to take out, so I try to scrape that part off. Just scrape all the shavings into the middle so that Huynh can rearrange them how she likes them later tonight when she goes to bed. And Lulu is supervising. Good morning, Lulu. She likes to stand here and watch me. As you can see, Lulu does not poop at all in her stall only pee.
this is Lulu's poop corner. It's gonna be a few poop videos in a row because when you're dealing with horses, this is basically 90% of your job is scooping poop, cleaning poop, trying to figure out how to deal with it, whether you spread it or compost it or take it somewhere or just let it pile up. Some people just do that. We have a hydraulic dump trailer that we take over to Green Mountain Compost once a week. And I will dump this in there right now. I dump directly into the trailer, which is great. In the winter we can't do that. In the winter I let it pile up and then I get rid of the pile first thing in the spring, as soon as I can. And it really cuts down on the fly population. And that's it. Like I said, super easy in the, in the summer. And I'll do another video this winter to show you how difficult it is if they're living outside this winter. We'll see. Depends on how many horses I have here at the barn.